Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Madison and I am so excited that 2020 is finally over and I know I'm not the only one who's ready for a COVID-19 vaccine. In the meantime, let's keep these masks on and stay safe. I'm sharing my daily mask makeup tutorial, starting out with proper skin preparation. Skincare is an important step to preventing as much acne as possible. I personally have experienced a lot of this mask knee situation in 2020, and I would like to avoid as much of it as I can in 2021. In this tutorial, I'm using three of my favorite daytime anti-acne products. Check out the description box below for all of the tools and products that are used in this video. The first step in mask makeup is measuring the face mask. I personally wear my face mask for at least 50 hours a week, which means I'm pretty much wearing it all day, every day. So I avoid wearing makeup underneath my mask. After mapping out my face, I begin the makeup application. We are skipping foundation today, and the first product we're going to be using is concealer. I'm using concealer underneath the eyes and anywhere that I want extra love and coverage. If you've watched any of my tutorials, you probably already know, my favorite tool for blending out the under eyes is a damp beauty sponge. This is the best product for blending out under eye concealer, preventing creases and applying a loose powder. I'm using a darker, warmer liquid to add some depth and dimension to the perimeters of my face. This is acting as a liquid bronzer to give me a little bit of color. Don't hold back on your powder application. A heavy packing of powder will help prevent transfer onto your mask. Next, I'm applying a heavy amount of bronzer. This may seem like a lot of bronzer, but this is a good amount that balances out the complexion of my body with my face. You just can't tell without the face mask on. Make sure you hit all the points of the skin that are not covered up by your mask. This will make sure everything looks cohesive and smooth without having to apply makeup underneath the part the mask covers up. I don't do this next step every day, but if you like the look of dimension, I love using a banana powder underneath the eyes and on the high points of the face to really give your face that nice lifted look. My favorite way to prep the eyes for eye makeup application is with a eyeshadow primer and a light dusting of powder. Bold brows are a must for mask makeup. Brows frame the face and help balance out the face mask.
When I'm wearing a face mask, I prefer to apply a light eye makeup look. That way, if or when the mask is removed, the difference feels a little less extreme. Oops, I make this mistake all the time. The best way to remove mascara mistakes is with a dry Q-tip. And if you're feeling fancy, go ahead and apply a pair of false eyelashes. Who says falsies and pandemics don't go together? I hope you enjoyed this makeup tutorial and I hope you are all staying safe and socially distant during this global crisis. It is so important to remember that this pandemic will pass. There are brighter days ahead and don't lose hope. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel and check out my Instagram. I will see you in my next video.